Welcome back to Outdoor Guys. Today I'm going to do a review on the Plano Edge Frog Box and it's a 3700 size box so it'll hold 50 frogs. I'm a fan of the whole Edge system. I'll link down in the video description below. Um, I have a bunch of their boxes. I'll roll in some B-roll so you guys can see what I do have. But I've done some other reviews on the Plano Edge tackle boxes. So, like I said, I'll drop them below. Check them out. I think this box is really cool, guys. I have four of them. I'm going to order two more. I have a ton of frogs. Um, I definitely have a problem. There's no question about that. But... I just really like the way this uh, Plano Edge frog box holds your frogs. You know, it ha and I'll show you guys in a second. It has five separate little holders and you know, each one of them holders holds 10 frogs. So I'll get into a little bit more here in a second, um, depending on the size of the frog. Like if you're putting a, a thicker, bigger frog in there, it can be a little bit trickier to fit them in there. But um, I got mine packed you know from side to side so i know in some of the videos i've seen on this box they like skipped one so instead of putting five on each side they were doing like three i got all my, i had all kind of different frogs and like i said i'll show you guys them any frog you can think of i basically have i think they did a really good job on the box so i just wanted to share it with you guys maybe it'll help you guys make a decision on whether this is a box you guys want to buy or not but um you know plano i think they're always doing they're staying ahead of the game they're always making it easier for us fishermen and being able to organize the tackle for me is the main thing like ease of use i like to have separate boxes for different stuff and i think it's really unique on how plano finds a purpose for each box you got to be organized especially when you have you know a boatload of bass fishing tackle so you know that just helps me do that i think also like you know you're getting a couple benefits out of the plano edge system like the restrictor in it it'll keep your you know baits from getting rusty made really well the latches and stuff on them are good i'm just gonna go through real quick you know the four boxes that i have how i have my frogs organized so the way i organized my boxes guys was my popping frogs so i got two boxes of those so any any brand of frog that's popping they went in them boxes and then i did one box for just my hollow body like walking frogs and I actually got a bunch of frogs on the floor. Like I said, I'm getting two more boxes, so I'll make another walking frog box. And then my other one is just a buzz frog box. So like any frogs with the buzz legs on the back of them, um, you know, the tackle, uh, sprinkler frogs, the scum frogs, the buzz frogs, anything like that, that type of frog. I think I got the tackle, the honker frogs in there too, but um, anything like that is going in that box so these boxes are still hard to get guys they just came out um, I got mine at Bass Pro for $44.99 and I was I ordered two that I liked them so much and I ordered two more and I went to go back and order two more and they're saying they're not going to be in stock till like late September now so I'm glad I was able to get my hands on a couple of them but if you guys can find them jump on them because i I feel like they're definitely going to be, you know, hard to get. They are already. I know they just came out, but um, I just wanted to let you know where I got them from, how much they cost. You know, keep checking online. I know Tackle Warehouse is supposed to get them soon, too. So I'm sure hopefully they'll get a big shipment in of them so you guys can get your hands on them. But anyway, I just wanted to share this video with you guys. If you haven't subbed, though, make sure you smash the subscribe button down for me. Drop a comment. Let me know if you guys were lucky enough to get your hands on any of these Plano Edge frog boxes. Also, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Ring the notification bell too, guys, so you get my content as soon as it drops. But real quick, I had all my frogs in a 3700 regular size like flambeau box. This Plano Edge box is basically, I feel like they both kind of held the same amount of frogs, but it's just the way the Plano Edge box does it. Like it's so much easier putting frogs in and you know, getting them out because you can lift the whole thing. Any row you want to lift out, it lifts out real easy. So like just that right there. Like I said before, anything that makes it easier for me, I'm all about. So like you're getting some advantages there. I think, you know, as far as storage, you're going to get about the same as a regular 3700 size box. Um, just wanted to put that out there. But all right, that's going to be it for this one. I just wanted to try to do a short video and uh, show you guys these 
Plano Edge 3700 size frog boxes. I wanted to show you guys, this is my tackle wall, but I just wanted to show you how crazy I am. So I had frogs all the way from one end to the other, and I was like, well, I got these boxes. I got a little extra room. So I took all my frogs that I had in packages off the wall and I put them in these Plano Edge boxes. So I got some room up there. That couldn't be a good and a bad thing. Trying to get rid of a lot of stuff, but you're always caught in that spot where it's like, whoa, is it more efficient to keep your baits up there or actually put them in boxes? But you know, in this case, I had some more room, but it did cost me a couple more boxes, but hey, I like them a lot. So I just wanted to show you that. Until the next one, you have officially been outdoors. <laughs>